Head and neck cancers are fairly treatable, but in removing tumors, patients often face devastating effects, losing part of their jaw or tongue, for example. The trend in surgical oncology is to offer more palpable procedures. After you take the cancer out, you have to be able to put them back together, if you will. And, you know, a big goal of ours is to give the, our patients a, a reasonable quality of life afterwards. A specialist in head and neck cancer surgery, Dr. Tony Infuso, is offering advanced techniques to patients in southwest Florida, including free flap reconstruction. That's where you take either some soft tissue from the arm or the thigh, or you can take bone from the leg and reconstruct a mandible, and you use that tissue to reconstruct their tissues of the head and neck. Building on better surgical options, today's oral cancer patients face a better future. The newly relocated tissue is altered to look and perform as closely as possible to the original, decreasing disfigurement and boosting quality of life, a far different outlook than in years past. If you go back to 10 years ago, uh, patients were getting more radical neck dissections, um, there was more uh, accessory nerve damage, um, radiation wasn't quite as pinpointed, chemo drugs were a little bit different, so you had a, a full gamut of different side effects. Many patients were left speechless or unable to eat or drink without a feeding tube. Consequences seen less frequently now, says speech pathologist Stacy Brill. We're still treating their swallowing deficits, they just had greater deficits. Removing cancer and a major side effect. Free flap reconstruction is changing the landscape. The chances of this flap surviving is, is higher today than it's ever been and we can do it in a shorter amount of time. That allow us to do bigger surgeries and you know try and tackle bigger cancers. Making life after cancer much easier to swallow. For Lee Memorial Health System, I'm Amy Usher.